Rodney Reed. A family fights for the life of a Texas man who may be executed soon for a crime they say he did not commit. You got the wrong man. We ask you to drop the charges right now. Rodney Reed's family wants his execution stopped and a new trial that they are convinced will show he is an innocent man. And we're trying to do everything we can to get a stay so we can present the evidence that proves he is innocent. But is he? After all, Reed's DNA had been found on the body of a young woman who had been murdered. And that was enough to convince a jury to send him to the death chamber. They got to cap the murder out of the deal and that's what they wanted. Stacy Stites was just 19 years old when she was killed. She was just as pretty on the outside as she was on the inside. Stacy seemed an unlikely victim. She worked at a grocery store and had been planning her wedding to a local police officer when her body was found along a country road. She had been working, paying off her dress, and doing a little bit each week to make sure that this wedding came off okay. And now somebody's taking that away. But what if Rodney Reed's DNA found on Stacy's body was there because they were having a secret affair? And what if the real killer was Stacy's fiance, who had found out about it? All the evidence that we've accumulated, it points to him. Rodney Reed's attorneys say they have new witnesses and new evidence that will clear his name. But can he get a new trial before his execution date? Reed waits on death row. I think that there's a fresh set of eyes on the case. I think that it's possible that I may be free. I try to stay optimistic about that anyway. Free Our podcast series, Texas Crime Files, Rodney Reed. Questions of truth and justice while life and death hang in the balance. Free